morning 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 all right so uh i'm starting this new thing it's called uh monday motivations so there's there's two parts to monday motivation there is mission work monday and then there is uh meditation monday where we meditate on the word so today i'm going to be talking about our mission work monday uh is a subject topic that's near and dear to my heart and the question is what is it like being a foster dad so uh being a foster dad is a uh, catch-22 but it's it's not it's not all bad right so one of the things that people always say uh, all the time is uh, that must be hard or uh, i couldn't imagine uh, having to give a kid back uh da 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 so for for me it's 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 not hard i, mean, I, I could probably rip off you know, 30 or 40 different uh, situations in my life that's been a lot harder than that. So it's easier for me to to give in this capacity. And I don't know if you uh, know my story, but how I uh, got into foster care, I grew up around group home kids. I grew up around foster kids. And uh, when I was in the eighth grade, I, I met a situation where um my my then girlfriend was getting raped by her, her her dad and that that planted a seed and when i was in college i had a vision uh a visitation um from god where he told me that this is where i was supposed to be so i'm being obedient uh in that and serving in that capacity but there's some great things that happen um you'll never get a thank you you'll never get uh <laughs> you really won't get any recognition but uh, I do receive a ton of love. I am able to provide some of the things that uh, were missing for me, some of the things that were ideal, and also some of the things that uh, I hope to um, pass on to the next generation. So uh, I love being a foster dad. So uh, I wanted to read this. It's it's in Isaiah. Isaiah one seventeen is where you where you first see this this calling. All right, it says. It says, learn to do right, seek justice, encourage the oppressed, defend the fatherless, plead the case of the widow. All right. So uh, Isaiah, my son, is named Isaiah uh, after the great uh, prophet Isaiah. And he's seen the furthest. Uh, he's seen from the beginning through Revelation. You see that um, his 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 vision of what he's seen, uh, of what God wants from us is is throughout the scripture so i wanted to read that to understand the baseline of where it comes from uh and and have a good day <laughs>